Miranda and today I am going to make pink drink popsicles. So at Walmart I found these super cute popsicle shapes. What are these called? Trays? They're so cute. These ones are pineapples and these ones are cactus, cacti. How do you say it? Cacti, right? Cactus ones are just so funny to me because in my family the cactus is like an inside joke. It all started with my aunt because to her it looks like the middle finger. I bet other people use it like that too, but now it's just become a big joke and my mom loves cactus. So anything I find that's cactus, you get the point. I have become very into making my own pink drinks at home. I actually can't even drink pink drinks from Starbucks because they have caffeine and I cannot have caffeine. A pink drink at home only requires two ingredients, three if you want to add in the dried strawberries. Let me show you. At Starbucks, all that goes into a pink drink is the strawberry refresher and then coconut milk. So what I have is this white cran strawberry juice and coconut milk. It literally tastes the exact same, it just doesn't have caffeine and so I can have it and I love it. So before I get started, I'm gonna wash and dry my popsicle shapes. All right, I'm gonna move you a little bit closer. You can see what's going on. So I just separated out some frozen strawberries and I'm actually going to cut them up now so that they're in small little pieces that will sit inside the popsicles. Okay, now that I have those chopped up, I am going to start mixing up the pink drink. So I wanna do mostly white currant strawberry and then just a little bit of coconut milk to top it off and make it creamy. I'm gonna start with that much, that seems like enough. And then just mixing in a little bit of coconut milk. It does look a little too light, so I think I'm gonna add a little bit more, like that much. Now all I'm doing is taking the trays and I'm gonna pour in that mixture. But you're gonna wanna leave a little bit of room because you do want space for the strawberries and you don't want it to overflow. Now, I'm just gonna place the strawberries kind of randomly. Actually, before I continue that, I'm gonna put in the, the popsicle sticks. Now, I'm just placing the strawberries randomly throughout the popsicle. I'm gonna do the same thing to the pineapple ones. I just spilled them a little, but it's okay. It's okay. Now it's time for the least fun part, which is letting these freeze. Such a boring process. They're in the freezer and I'm just gonna let them sit for as long as they need. I kind of made a huge mess because my ring light cord hit the drinks. Also, I definitely overfilled the pineapple ones because they were spilling everywhere when I was trying to carry them. It's currently 7.06 p.m. so I might check them before bed or I might just check them in the morning. Okay, it's the next day and this is the moment. Let's see. They look so cute already, I'm so excited. All right, so this is what they look like, frozen, solid, in the trays. I am so excited to try these, wow. My house is so hot, they're gonna melt so fast. I'm super excited about the cactus ones, so I guess I'm just gonna go for that first. Why am I scared to like break this? Were there tips? I don't know, I threw away the box. Oh, they're coming out easy. This is so cute! Are you kidding me? I am obsessed with this! Look how cute these are! These are exactly how I envisioned. Smell check, 10 out of 10. They maintained their smell. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Again, are you kidding? These are so cute! All right, now I'm just licking them all, but I'm the only one that will eat them anyway. Jordan doesn't like this. These are adorable. <laughs> these are seriously melting so fast already, so I guess that means it's time to end this video. Wow, I love these. I think I'm just gonna keep making these instead of making pink drinks because they're so convenient. If you guys try these, please tag me. I will have my socials right here and in the end slate at the end of the video and in the description box down below. Also, if you haven't already, please go check out my giveaway, which is probably up by now. It's to celebrate hitting 2,000 subscribers, which I'm so grateful for, so thank you guys so, so much for that milestone. I'm just like, ugh, that's amazing. Anyway, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe so you never miss a video. Follow me on all my socials and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!